Hi, I'm Veronica Gale, and I am a production coordinator here at Perception. I grew up in Wayne, New Jersey, been there all my life. Um, when I was growing up, I always wanted to be a Broadway star, specifically in the show Wicked, if possible. Obviously, things didn't pan out that way. Um, my first job, I actually got two jobs at the same time with the same boss. One of them was I was a dance teacher for little kids ages like four to five, um, ranging to about middle school age. And the other job I had is I was very good friends with Moana at kids' birthday parties. Um, I went to Seton Hall University, and before that, in high school, um, I took a TV production class. I thought it would be fun, and I ended up really liking it and deciding I wanted to study that through college. So I decided to major in film and TV, and now I'm here. Fun fact about me is I actually used to work for a heavy metal radio station. So my first day of perception was really fun. I started my day getting locked out of the building because it's high security here, so it's hard to get in the door. Um, but I just watched people, met people, and it was a good day. My favorite thing about working at Perception is just all the cool stuff you get to work on. Saying you're a part of all these really cool movies and TV shows and tech things, it's just really fun to say, hey, like, I did something on that, so that's pretty cool. The best advice I would give to someone entering this line of work is the answer is always no until you ask. It doesn't hurt to ask the question. People tend to like questions. And if the answer is no, you might as well ask because the worst that's going to happen, you're in the same space you are now. So, I love any movie that involves dance. I don't know why. Footloose, Dirty Dancing, two of my faves. My dream project for Perception to work on would be any Disney princess film, that'd be so fun, or anything composed by Lin-Manuel Miranda. I have a couple favorite TV shows. I tend to watch TV more than movies. Um, Bridgerton and Ted Lasso are probably my two faves at the moment. One of my favorite projects Perception has worked on, I was not a part of, I wasn't working here yet, was the WandaVision title sequence. It's stunning, it's gorgeous. I feel like that's everyone's favorite, but it's basic because it's good, so. So probably my first mentor in like the TV film space was probably my high school TV teacher, Mr. Hookstreet. Um, he really pushed us to keep following our dreams, keep going. He gave us a lot of creative freedom to do what we want and run things how we wanted to. So that really helped. The best advice I've been given is to just go for it. You know, you got to go for your dreams or else you're going to regret not doing it. So you might as well just try and see what happens. What's the worst that can happen, you know? A day in the life of Veronica at Perception changes day by day. Usually I start, get here, obviously I need my cup of tea. I answer my emails. The problem with having all your clients on the West Coast you tend to have a lot of emails in the morning. So that's usually the first part of my day. Then sending things, downloading things, any tech issues that come up, helping to resolve those. We need some freelancers. All right, let me look, see what we need. Um, I'm now editing our newest reel, so doing some editing work, having a couple meetings where I take some notes, and shutting down for the day. So doing all those things in whatever order they happen to appear is kind of basically the day. Some of my best personal practices when it comes to working is, especially when I'm working from home, I try to change locations a lot. So that means maybe I'm starting at my desk, maybe midday I'm at my kitchen table, and maybe at the end of the day I'm back to my desk. That little change in my day helps. Also, I think it's helpful every once in a while, strike up a conversation with someone. It stops you from working a little bit, it's a little bit of a break in there, and then you get back to work. It helps to avoid burnout. If I could give my first day of perception self one piece of advice, it would be you are going to make mistakes and that is completely okay. 
Mistakes are a part of learning, and anytime you start a new job, obviously, mistakes are bound to happen. So making a couple mistakes here and there, it's not the end of the world. Just try to recover as best you can.